Yeah, so we're, we're running t- tight on time here. I just realized where we're at here. So let's. Oh, you and I can talk forever. That's I know. <laughs> let's, let's jump into favorite moments real quick. Then we're going to reveal the fan poll. And like I said, two sleeves, both fill a trick. Stick around to the end. We got something good for you. So favorite moments of 2021. I mean, there were so many for me. Uh, I mean, clearly the USFL coming back, the XFL timelines, hearing from the XFL. But me personally, I'd have to say the the Spring League Mega Bowl, as strange as that might sound to most of you folks, but I was actually there live covering the game. And, I mean, the atmosphere, there wasn't a lot of people in stands, but you could still feel it. Those players that were putting, they put on a hell of a game, right? And it, it could have been anybody's game. We had the jousters, we had the linemen, Ryan Willis pulling in the MVP, which I think he totally deserves it. As we mentioned earlier, he's got a spot on the Bears. And if that doesn't work out, I expect or hope at least that we'll see him in the USFL. Just don't give him to the Generals. Give him to the Houston Gamblers. I don't care what anybody has to say. What about Michigan, man? I want my Panthers to have him. You okay, know? I, you know what? I'll take it. it the, either the Panthers or the Gamblers. That's why I have a North team and a Southern team. You know, I'm, I was born in Michigan, but I live in Texas. So, Oh, yeah, that's right. So that fits the bill perfectly. Hey, it's, still, it's still the last uh, professional football team to win a championship in the state of, fo- uh, state of football, state of Michigan. Uh <laughs> So before I go further, what I mean, what what's your favorite moment of the year? There's a lot, but what, what's well, your top one? Well, the one that I was hyped for earlier that I, I'll repeat it, it, just the announcement of the USFL, because I, I know that we had people that like, there are a lot of good people that we know that like to dig for information, kind of like how people mine for like gaming info in mm-hmm. the gaming community. The, the alternative football community is great at like digging up things, whether it's trademarks or other nuggets. And, you know, when they found those trademarks under the TSL, I was like, okay, maybe they do something. Mm-hmm. And then Fox got involved, like, okay, maybe they do something. And then when they announced it and they pulled the trigger, I lost it because I love looking back at the USFL of old. I know it's not the same for those that are OG fans. Mm-hmm. I get that. But I love looking back at that league and in the history and nostalgia it has of people that respected that and giving it a second chance. The league that really gave other leagues a nod in saying this can work. You just got to fix our mistakes. I thought that was incredible. They brought it back. And the fact that Fox said, screw it, you know, we're going to beat it. We're going to do it our way and we'll make this a competition. (laughs) You know, they got tired of waiting around and they said, we can make this work. Yeah. We have our own company. Like, sure. Let's take a chance and make this our football league made by a broadcaster. I loved, I love the announcement and I just love that there's more competition and more chances for players. That's the best. Re- to me, it's the best moment of the year because of that. And the fact that somehow it returned, I just didn't see it coming back. And we're like so close now to year long football. Because yes, maybe not next year, but 2023, if all goes as planned, oh my God. we have NFL, Super Bowl, XFL, XFL championship goes right into the USFL. And what is that? A couple weeks, maybe? And then we have the yeah. CFL. Oh my God. The 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 prophecies are going to be foretold. I I I this is what I dream of. This is what we dream of. I know is to have year round leagues we can love. And this is so close. 2023 can be that. I know. I I think it is going to be that. It's, I will weep. At least for one year, I truly believe we're going to get that back-to-back football. I'm excited yeah. to see it. 